taught me everything I know. <laughs> oh man, don't put that on me. Don't put that on me. So my fear was, which I put in, was that it was going to tear up. I've already seen it. That got grass coming up. It was going to tear it up. But what I really wanted to do, without taking a hand rake, was go around and around and up and down and fill in all the little grooves where the waters ran. And it did perfectly. You probably can't see it on the camera, but very few places I didn't even use. Well, we can see. Yeah. Can you see that? So this is where the water ran from Maybe. like your downspout. There's a downspout back there by Libby's, by our dog pen. Just like you were gonna plant a crop. I had already seeded it, but had I not, that's ready to be put some seed on. And then the next step, and I also showed too, I, I did for more weight, because this was hard as a rock. I put two big rocks on here and helped tremendously. I probably didn't have to, but it kind of cut the work in half. I could have gone around and around, but it, it so perfectly laid that out. And oh yeah, we can see the lines there. Oh, man. I'd already seeded it or you could, but anyway, so what I'm going to do now is just turn this to smooth it out and all you got to do, I've never done this before, so let's see how easy that is, flip it over, this fits right over your hitch, Jack. That's what I was going to ask is, fits right over that, look, and it's easy, you can pull it. You can pull it if you do Yeah, curl. all we had to do. If you curl 500 pounds in each hand, you can do it. That's right, right. that's right, man. <laughs> yeah. You gotta work out. Now, here's the thing. I gotta get this, these hooks. Pull these hooks out here. It's got, see, it's got, I could hook that other end on here. So the way you had it, it was kind of like an extra course. Kayla explained it this way. It's aggressive, less aggressive, and non-aggressive. And I had it, if, it, if I had it on aggressive, it would have torn up every rock I had, which is what I want to do on my base rock driveway. You can see what we have here. See, yeah. the, see just the... Did the water uncover that? Yeah, the water uncovered this rock. So down here, I'm gonna put it on the aggressive side. I don't care if it tears this up. I got no grass, I got nothing to lose here. Cause the water's already. Yeah, look at here, see yeah. this? See what it did? If I didn't do that, I would have to cover all this up with dirt first. So what I'm gonna do is I'll, I'll go around and around here. It'll seek its own level, fill that in. Then I'll put some dirt over it. If I can go around and around here, I'll hook the other four by four on. I'll have an eight foot long section. Man, this is saving me so much labor and time. It's ridiculous. Because we brought in, I say we, you guys brought in like hundreds of loads of fill dirt. So we knew we had rocks here, yeah. but you've actually put topsoil on this before. Uh, actually here, no, but it ran from what I put Oh, I got here. you. I got you. Last year, what happened, you know, the heat caught me and I, I can't water this much. And so I, I couldn't get it growing. You can see the grass down here, but it wasn't enough to hold the dirt in or the seed or the seed i beg your pardon yeah dirt and seed both so i lost it all down there and if you've ever done yards you know exactly what i'm talking about it can be really frustrating and I, I i tried to manufacture one of these in fact chad helped me we used a chain link fence you remember the chain link yeah fence? it was a chain link fence and oh, some and like a cattle panel it was a and uh inch and a quarter yeah rebar yeah exactly and there was inch and a quarter rebar and we made a square out of it yeah we tried and we that. just put rocks on the back <laughs> yeah, of it man it and was, tried to drag it around. I'm, the, the concept was there. It, it looked like something your high school baseball coach dragged oh, the field absolutely. with. Man, you talk about jury rig. <laughs> to keep the dirt down, but it, it. didn't work at all. Yeah, less aggressive, see? Flip that over, and uh, I can see those <clears> hooks. <throat> There's five hooks across here. There's that four hooks, I beg your pardon, four. Now I'll drag it like that, and that is, that's not, that's not going to tear anything up. All that's going to do is bury the seed and smooth everything out that I've got. And I'm done. All I got to do is water. Or, of course, every time I seed and do something, we get a, you know, a flood. So anyway, Tartar, Tartar hooked us up with this. And they sent you two of them. They sent me two. There's one bar, two four befores, and at some point, I'd like to today. I got, I'm dying to try this out on that base rock driveway, man. I'm going to turn it over on aggressive. Tears it up, tears it up. I say tear up, but I mean, it's going to do what it's supposed to do. And uh, that'll be really, really cool. Well, we need it to because just like over here, the water rushed down here and that's what yeah. caused the ravines. But over there, you've added base rock since you moved in. Oh. And it's not like you can't backtrack it with your bucket, I've done that. but it's not as efficient. It's not like it finds its own level as quick. You gotta make a lot of passes. Whereas yeah. this, you're gonna put it on aggressive and just rip it up? Yeah, uh, the box blade, I took off some of the high areas, but grandma is on me because she likes a smooth ride. 
and if I don't get this done, I'm, I'm out. Because the 2020 pilot she has apparently isn't apparently smooth they, enough. They don't make shocks on a 2020 pilot, <laughs> did it? So Grandma's not here, so we can say that. Every time she pulls in, hey, you going to fix that driveway today? <laughs> Today's the day. <laughs> Tartar is going to save my marriage. You can't tell there's a ridge. I took the box plane, went over and over, did as best I could. You didn't have to have a, a rake uh, behind the tractor. No idea that you could use this on base rock until I saw the video that Kayla made from Target. Right, right. So when you go to their website and you look up any piece of equipment, at least all of them have their cedars, they have a video. We'll link it down below. And it's only a couple minutes long. That's oh, a yeah, nice thing. Oh, no, yeah. It's just a how-to real quick. And I learned everything I knew. I had to know about the Harrow and the cedar they sent. And, and uh, so we're good to go. You can see I drug it right there. Just, oh, yeah. So, yeah, man. It's uh, pretty slick. Pretty slick, it is. So I'm gonna go around here a couple times. I just woke up, by the way. It's noon. I'm just <laughs> yeah, yeah. I I started to wait on him. I started to wait on him. I said, hey, I, I got to do something. I, I'll, I'll videotape it. I'll do the best I can. And he oh can yeah. Edit the daylight's out of it. Grandpa graciously. Have you guys noticed you've never seen me fill up the feed buckets? <laughs> I, I haven't bought feed. Or even refilled the buckets in six months. Uh, yeah, I, I carried some down for the beefy boys today, yep. but that's all right. I'm... So Saturdays and Sundays, Grandpa handles the chores, and then Case and I or Adler, whoever, whoever, we come out later in the afternoon and hang out and do stuff yeah. like this. Hey, so I got a turn for what the difference between what you do and I do. You got the bougie job. The bougie. Bougie. Is that what you say? No, that. Uh... You got the bougie job. I do the grunt work. It's all good. You yeah. ran. You ran a hundred feet of fence, right? And I ran the other. Oh, no, yeah. you did help really? me with half. Is that how that went? Yeah. Oops, my bad. I bet it's probably pretty my close. Bad. Hey, folks, I embellish. I bet it's okay. probably, it's probably I embellish. pretty close. That's what I do. Either way. All right, so you're going to drag it? I'm going to drag it. Let's see what And happens. this is just, we're going to link this down below, but this is just one, right? Just one. I got another one. I got another we got, we got two of them, but this is just okay. one, so you don't have to buy two. Yeah. No, this, yeah, this worked great up here because what's obviously you can't, with a four wheeler, you can't make sharp corners right you know i mean you get in fact you get yourself in a bind you got to back up you have to back up which i did one time while we go to take that off this thing you, you know you take it off and then get yourself situated so you gotta make your corners oh, i think man. you guys can see that are you kidding i mean for for how many years i've been 40 years for 40 years i've been using a yard rake like a hand rake like a hand rake i've been using a hand rake for 40 years that's why your arms look like they do though it's right it's all raking i don't go to the gym i just rake that's all i do man he has a gym membership but you don't go <laughs> See the seed right there. Yeah, I mean that's that just that's that's phenomenal.
we had we had like probably two weeks of rain every other day. Yeah. And I had we had just water grooves in there, and I came out last week to tackle that, and I just gave up because it was just too hard. I knew that this hair ore was coming in, but I get I get impatient. I'm just I just am. I just, I just wanted to get it done. Well, and we're talking. I mean, to credit, like, can we show them the big one yeah. over here? Yeah. These were the size of the ruts that you had. Oh gosh, yeah, right here. This is what these were running right down the middle of the the, the front yard. They're not quite so many rocks, but they were going. They were. They were. Yeah, not as rocky. Good. We're talking about the dirt and stuff yeah, like I had that. Half a dozen or so. You can you know and and and. Uh, it was just too much to take on, so I just told myself, hold on, just just, just be patient. And uh, that thing came in the other day. I couldn't wait to get started. So yeah, they're all going. You know, I can, uh, we're waiting on, I ain't waiting on the rain now, and then, and I'm, I'm pretty excited on how this will look. As long as it'll get too much, but. You guys wonder where I get my driving habits. Now, Grandma better get on to you like she does me. For I ripping, it from you. For ripping her nose. No, no. Uh -uh. Yeah, I don't no, drive no. that way. Defensive driving is driving faster than everyone else. I never thought about it that way. Yeah. You get out of the way, you can't get hit. I don't remember that telling you guys that when you learned how to drive. But. No. <laughs>